Hey, in this video we're going to talk about some of the multitasking gestures that you can use in iOS 7 that make a difference to how you use your iPad and uh, make things a lot easier for you. So uh, the first um, multitasking gesture I want to use is with one finger. If you flick down from the top of your iPad screen, you get your notification center. If you, if you flick up from the bottom of your iPad screen, you get Control Center, which allows you to switch on and off airplane mode, Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, Do Not Disturb, um, Mute, AirPlay, your screen to another AirPlay-enabled device like an Apple TV, go to Timer, take a photo, manage your brightness and contrast, your volume, and play and pause forward things, uh, the music and videos that you're watching. And that's one finger up from the bottom. You can also one finger down in the middle and you get your search bar. And in this case I was searching for Twitter and you can just tap on the app and go directly to Twitter. Now there's some multitasking gestures that are really useful once you have an app open. Uh, one of them is the multitasking bar. You can either use the little circle that's on the outside frame of your iPad and double tap that uh, double click it if you like and you will get the multitasking bar or what I always use is four fingers up on your iPad and when you do four fingers up it gives you your multitasking bar all the apps that are currently open so there's Twitter there's Facebook pages manager you know, photo gene the weather the iTunes store and you can see that you can scroll through them and if you want to go to this app just tap on it and it will bring you to the next app. So that's four fingers up from the bottom and choose the next app that you want. However, there's an even faster way to get between apps. So if you know that you wanted to go from here to the Facebook Pages Manager app, you could use the same four fingers and grab the app and push it off to the side. And you've got the next app in the queue in line. You can grab that up and you can push it off and here we are in Photogene. You can grab it again and push it off to the side and we've got the weather. And you can also do the same four fingers back the other direction and view the apps in a line. So that's four fingers up, brings you to your multitasking bar, or four finger drag moves you there we go, on to the next screen. So that's a little handy couple of tips about multitasking gestures. Ah, and that last one, which I didn't show you, which is five finger pinch. If you're on an app and you want to go back to your home screen, you just use all five fingers and pinch it down. Or, oh, I want it back up again. No, let's pinch it down. And we are back to where we started from. So they're the multitasking gestures. I hope you enjoyed this little video. Uh, visit us again at ipadfamily.com.au or facebook.com slash ipadfamily.